All right, folks. Knocking out from our right. In the lead is a P51 Mustang, painted up in RCAF colors. And in behind is your P40. is at the controls of this incredible P-40. The P-40 was the development of the radial engine P-36 Hawk. prototype was a converted Hawk with the R1830 Allison V liquid cooled engine. It was first flown in October of 1938. It was evaluated at Wright Field in May of 1939 and that resulted in an order of 524 aircraft. Of course, although the P-40 was best known for using the Allison V-12 engine, the P-40F and L models were powered by the Packard Berlin engine. Over 13,700 P-40s have been built. <laughs> Showing us the incredible turning capability of the P-40 Kitty Hawk. Now remember I was telling you a little bit about the Canadian history of Club Crazy that was being flown by Vicky Benzing earlier in her air show program. This aircraft also has a connection to the Royal Canadian Air Force. It was uh, purchased direct from Curtis by the British Purchasing Commission. It was delivered to the RAF in 6 November 1941. It was allocated to the Royal Canadian Air Force. It served with 111 Squadron. States Army Air Force and upgraded with the powerful, reliable Rolls-Royce Merlin engine, which also powered the Supermarine Spitfire. stands for? It stands for Pursuit. This was changed in 1948 to F for Fighter. So it later became known as the F-51. was up. Check out this next pass from our right. The P-40 and P-51 Mustang from the Eric's.
coming in this time from our left. As Ross Stratley and Mike Oliver come in again from our left. <laughs> pounds on three hard points, one under the fuselage and two under wing. The Mustang also could carry 2,000 pounds of bombs or 10 5-inch rockets. Look at this right at show center coming straight for us. Just like his dad bought. 